Hemsbok are antelope known for their strength and endurance. They're being moved to prevent overgrazing. Uh, these are very aggressive animals because we're basically putting them under stress. And as you can see, the horns as we're coming through now, they're rather unpleasant. And there's always a risk. Well, uh, first gate, open this gate, two more. There's too many for the truck. First thing we do is when they get into the crush, which is the metal bit at the end, uh, we put pipes on their head because otherwise they can kill each other. We can't reduce the stress completely, but we'll try and reduce it as much as possible. So that's for the use of tranquilizers. One of them I've got up here, which is a tranquilizer that I believe is used in human medicine for schizophrenia. I haven't tried it myself, but it works very well on the, on the game. Just wait, wait, wait. Give them some room. Give them some room. Now, unfortunately, what we have is a very narrow passageway here with one facing the wrong way. So, um, we're just going to try to turn it around and then hopefully they'll go through. In a situation like that, when, it, when an animal's facing you and we panic at it, it's going to run the way it's facing. Put their horns down and then they'll come in for you. And that's that's a dangerous situation. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, that's the border. Okay. So that's why we use the board, and it's, it's a very thin piece of metal. It's only like two, two millimeters thick. So the horns do go through it, but it just gives us enough time to jump out the way as well. Board. Okay, Pulgani, that baby's down there underneath this one. That's fine, that's fine. In all the excitement, three baby Hemsbok have been separated from the herd. So the team put them in a pen with all the females that are carrying milk, where they hope the babies will find their mums. There they are. We'll probably give them 24 hours. If there's really nothing going on, the best option for them is to be taken away. I don't like that. I don't like doing it, but it's, it is the best option because if there's any element of doubt, they're just going to starve. So what we're going to do is, is, is take them away and start hand-rearing them. But I want to give them a chance, first of all, because we have got a couple of females there with others. 